Ah, welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Starfield Mall. I want to say I could get on over there, but now nah, let me go ahead and walk this way. Do things the right way. <laughs> Trying to find my way inside this thing. I may or may not get in here. They may say, young fella, you going the wrong way. <laughs> but it's all good, man. Let's get inside this mall real quick. Hey man, unlike malls in uh, the Philippines where they got security guards, you just walk right in. Let's go. Hello. Hello. I'm just looking for the library. Library for school. Fourth. All right. All right. Look like we're heading to the fourth, y'all. So that's called the London Bagel Museum. I heard the lines for that particular place can range up to like five hours waiting time for people to eat at the London Bagel Museum. I don't think in this world I'll ever be that hungry. I can't imagine ever being that hungry that I'm willing to wait five hours to eat a bagel. Nah, I'm good, but I'll, I'll go somewhere else, believe that. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. A store called Studio Tomboy. That's that's interesting. I like that. That 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 that's another topic for another day for sure. Let's go ahead and check out this library. Man. Wow. 
Would you look at that? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not gonna lie. I feel like this is a place the wife would appreciate a little bit more because she's more of a reader than I am, but you have to be able to respect the pure aesthetics of everything that's going on around here. I think this is pretty cool. The stairs and shit, that's it. Oh, that's I need to go over there. Mm -hmm. take a seat right here. <sighs> I'm gonna take a seat right here. Oh, they be screaming at each other. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, can't lie to you. I don't read very much at all. Never been much of a reader. Kind of just get my education by picking up on cues and stuff, hitting up the bullet points and keeping it pushing. But this is definitely one of those experiences that I do appreciate if you are a reader, right? Now, nobody's sitting here thinking that you're gonna read all the books in here, <laughs> anything like that. Some of the books are unattainable. You can't even reach them if you want to, but at the same time, you do have to appreciate the aesthetics and the time put in to create such a beautiful little area here in Suwon, man. I think that this is definitely a spot worth checking out. It's located in Starfield Mall. Um, it's a small little location, but Starfield Mall in itself has a lot of things. There's four floors. This is located on the fourth floor. Um, just called the Starfield Library if you get lost. Beautiful young lady downstairs helped me at information and told me exactly where to go. So... I'm going to kick it here for a minute, take time to relax. Your boy's been on his feet for a second. Probably trying to find me something to eat before I head back over to my hotel. All right, but one more time for everybody who didn't catch the view. Let's rock this out before we get on to the next scene. They even have a vinyl radio record section. That's cool. Oh, I think you gotta pay to get into it. It's like a cafe. I ain't worried about it. Yeah, you gotta pay to sit inside here. But they got record players and shit. It's kind of hard to see from here. But they got record players with headphones so you can sit, enjoy some coffee, and actually a good record. I ain't gonna lie to you. I am one of those people I love, you know, my streaming services and all that stuff, not gonna lie to you, but I am one of those people that do believe that records are best played on vinyl. Like, listening to it on vinyl just seems to be a little bit different than just streaming it or cassette tape or CD player and all that stuff. Vinyl just hits different. I don't know, maybe it's the headphones, I don't know, but they have a place there, it looks like it's gonna cost you 18.5, if I remember correctly, give me a second. 
see if I can read that song. So anybody who knows how to speak Korean, <laughs> I assume they're telling me it's gonna cost me 18,500 Korean won in order to be able to enjoy a session there inside of the uh, booth. It's not a bad business idea. Some people still are captivated by the allure of vinyl, right? Even some of your favorite artists. I'm not saying that she's your favorite artist, but I've recently saw Taylor Swift put a lot of her shit on vinyl and I don't know. I think the wife wanted it. I didn't buy it, but it don't matter. Music is still music, but I do believe that vinyl does have a different kind of quality of taste. And it's also located on or attached to the library. So you can kind of sit in there and get a view of the library from where you're sitting at. So that's kind of cool as well. So just something to consider if you guys are, you know, radio or music heads or anything like that and you want to go check it out. All right, let's go explore some more Starfield Mall, y'all. By the way, I did lie. There's more than four floors. It's just the library's on the fourth floor. I think there's a total of maybe eight floors total, or seven, something like that. So golf is actually a very popular sport here as well. So they have a lot of stores dedicated just to golf stuff. Like as you can tell, or maybe you can't see the entire side over here. You got AK Golf, something called WAC, W-A-A-C, Adidas Golf, um, something called the Rudy Project. And on the other side of that is Under Armour Golf. Um, even on this side, the Golden Bear like everything golf related right so my brother says the top sports here are not in any particular order because i don't know the order uh baseball golf and fuck i forgot the last one he said but baseball and golf round out the top three um sports that are popular here i can't remember the last one i'll ask him later but it's almost as if this entire second floor is dedicated or sixth floor excuse me to golf style products see Nice little, <laughs> that's cool. Hmm. I'm sure they're gonna charge me an arm and a leg for that. <laughs> okay. And this here is the other side of the mall, I'm sorry, the library, on the uh, second floor above. Gotta take their pictures, boy. Just like Filipinos, man. Shit don't, shit don't change. <laughs> but hey, I might as well get one too, right? Selfie. Ugh. Yeah, that works. <laughs> that might be the thumbnail. <laughs> that might be the thumbnail. Uh, all right, y'all. I think I'm gonna go find me something to eat. Let's go find something to eat real quick. That place got a line of people. And what I see is there's a lot of places with a lot of lines, y'all. Like, everybody's got a line. Place called Eatopia. I assume this is the uh, food court. Gonna lie, somebody sticks out like a sore thumb here. Thank you. 
Oh snap, looks like we made it to the top floor where the library is. And all we gotta do is look down. Oh, mm. There we go. So this is the top floor view of what it looks like over here. That's cool. Okay. Look like they got their own little movie screen here too. Movie theater. They call it Mega Box. You can get your own tickets and your popcorn and stuff in here. Let's go check it out. I'm assuming that's what it's for. Maybe I'm tripping. Nah, self ticketing. Okay. Yeah, this is this is their movie theater for sure. So they got their own self ticketing place to buy their popcorn and then a self soda bar huh. I see nobody working the counter that's crazy oh there they go cool and then your self soda bar all right let me get out of here before I get in trouble <laughs> uh, yeah I wonder what's playing they don't have any like uh, I guess I gotta go to the kiosk let's see what they got Assuming this is tickets. <laughs> uh, okay, so they got. Fuck, I don't know what none of these are. <laughs> so they only have four movies to play in this time around. That looks like the emotional or element. I remember the first one. This might be the second one. I think. <laughs> but yeah, they only got four movies playing. That's what's up. And I guess you pay it all here if you want to go ahead and get your movie, popcorn, and all that stuff. You know. That's it. This is actually, excuse me, right here. It's a handball court. I like handball. I used to play handball a lot when I was a kid. And not no more. Too old for that. Don't ask me to run nowhere, please. <laughs> yeah, Carter ain't running nowhere. It, it ain't happening. All right, y'all, I gotta find me something neat. <laughs> hey, let me go outside first. Uh, let's see what's outside. A couple stairs, let's see where they lead. Beware of stairs. Keep forgetting how old I am, bro. This ain't it. Stairs is not my bestie anymore, man. Ugh. We walk flat surfaces. <laughs> Let's see what's at the top of these stairs. It's hot, though. It's a hot day, y'all. Like a little rooftop sitting area. My assumption is this is a place for you to take your dog. That's what it looks like, a little dog park. <laughs> Plot of dirt. Man, 
Not gonna lie, man. If you're not familiar with what's upstairs, I mean, a lot of these stores can be missed out on. Uh, yeah, it is. One thing I noticed, man, they take care of their dogs here like they're family. Sound familiar? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, that's okay. Okay, I'm done. It's like the whole top part is basically a place to kind of take and play with your dogs and stuff. That's what it is. That's why I'm out here looking stupid. Little dog park here. Okay. So this is on the um, upper floor outside. They really do treat their dogs like family. <sighs> yes, ladies and gentlemen, today has been adventurous nonetheless, but I think it's time for me to go ahead and sign out, man. We've gone to a couple places and stuff. Glad I finally got to see the library. That's definitely an experience I'll take with me forever because it really is a dope little spot. Can't even hold you, all right? So I think it's time for the good doc to go ahead and close this one out. It has been fun. It has been real. I'm going to have to catch y'all on the next one, man. Peace.